The approach for this film was pretty much Marty started it out as he wanted it to be hip and cool and fresh. And going from there, it really didn't fit to just do a conventional orchestral score. So we were really looking for something that is still scary, but has this cool, fresh hipness. And we ended up using a lot of distorted guitars, weird elements, synth elements, but kept the orchestral elements in there as well, but not in a prominent way. Dylan? Some interesting elements that we used on the score were like boat glasses, boat with a uh, bass bow. Um, we also used rubbed glasses, just regular wine glasses that were filled to a different degrees, which is basically laid out over like, an entire keyboard. Another element specifically for Spider, which again comes back to the um, electric guitars, I used a um, baritone guitar, which is basically a very low-tuned electric guitar, but it really has a lot of a lot of oomph. Outside the emotional aspects, I always try to approach those in a thematic way. I'm not a big fan of trying to approach emotion indirectly. I do it from time to time, and I think we've done it a couple times in this film, but some of the bigger emotional impacts is one of those moments where we just have a theme uninhibited played out. And that's something that always works well for me, I think, when we just play it honest. I would say the one thing I really like the most is the main character, or killer. Purely because I've never seen or never scored a killer the way he's portrayed. This killer is in your face and he doesn't have a problem slashing your throat and do it in a very cool way. Uh, I think that's the way we scored it. And I definitely think it's been one of the most boldest approaches for something like that. I mean, to just come out and kick you in the face musically. <laughs> <laughs> 